Hi Gemini, welcome back to I Enigma. This is Enigma. I'm going to be doing a general reading between June 8 to 14. Let's see the messages for your Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus sign in Gemini. Cards have been shuffled before. So let's see. For personal readings, white spells, or premium charge crystals, reach out to me on WhatsApp, Instagram, or email. All the details are in the description box on this video. Let's see the messages to you. Okay, someone is very interested in you and it's more like they are playing it really cool with you and it's more like a physical interest and something spiritual. It's not coming from the ground of emotional belonging or attachment. There's someone that likes to talk to you, they're attracted towards you, but they're always open to other options. Now, I'm seeing uh, you already have an idea that this person is just looking for something really casual and short term because as long as they're um, waiting for you to open up physically this person is going to be by your side and the moment their interest ends in you they will leave you know this thing so what you've decided right now is to start to distance yourself from this person particularly in Aries, Sagittarius or a Leo. I'm seeing someone new is stepping in. This new person that's stepping in is uh, coming towards you with passion, fast moving energy. They're very rich and successful. This person may not be that attractive but they definitely have a big bang balance. But the idea for you to be in a relationship is simply based on emotions. But since you know that the person that you are right now talking to is only involved or interested in you as long as you look amazing or attractive, you have this idea and they're trying to avoid the topic of seriousness or emotional intimacy, you've decided to walk away or you've decided to close the chapter in no time. You want to close the chapter in no time because you have someone new stepping in. You don't want to hurt this person because you feel according to you should be loyal, but then you also know that this person can leave you anytime. So you started to open up to new love options here. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn or Aries, Sagittarius, Leo interested. There are two people interested in you and making a move towards you. But you're taking your time realizing what you're supposed to do because you don't want to cut off ties with the one that you're interested in or who is uh, physically interested in you. I'm seeing you still want to not give up on this person. A part of you still hopes that they will understand your worth and they'll value you more than just your body. So you do have this kind of feeling deep inside of you that maybe they'll come running after me when I'm not there. Okay. You are very happy and confident, Gemini. I'm not seeing you're in this crying energy, uh, regretful energy, emotional energy at all. You're in this energy of welcoming light, welcoming happiness, welcoming new love. I'm seeing you're more focused on your personal growth. You're more focused on your own life and your priorities are uh, you. Anything that is linked with you. A new beginning in your life is happening in the near future. I'm seeing a solid foundation at work. I'm seeing you feeling really proud of yourself. With or without lovers coming into your life, you don't care because your seat is permanent. You feel like you're very happy wherever you are. You have a stable foundation. You're, you're doing what you wanted to do. That is more than enough. And you're positive. Some of you are going to give birth to a baby boy. I'm seeing someone is pregnant watching this. However, I'm seeing that more than that, I feel Gemini, you will be attracting love offers. You know why? Because you're becoming more and more successful. You're in this happy-go-lucky energy. You are also getting a lot of attention. I'm seeing you have power. I'm seeing you're influential these days. You're feeling proud of yourself. You're feeling successful. You're feeling in your power. So you feel like you're strong, you're powerful, you're energetic and you can have anything, you can win anything in this world. So you're not crying or waiting on someone. You just simply don't want to hurt anyone. You're being concerned about not uh, putting someone in problems or dangers because of you. You're in this positive energy right now, extremely healing, positive people do rely on you. They never argue with you because they know you know it all. So you're in this know-it-all energy and solid foundation in your life. 
I'm seeing the period of successes begin. Okay. I'm seeing you moving on from these options, focusing on yourself. So all the limelight is on you. And you don't want to focus on these love offers. Because at the night time, you feel like, you know, you feel stalking this person. Sometimes you do feel low at night time. So you're avoiding their thoughts. You're avoiding their uh, presence in your life. And just trying to focus on work and personal growth and achievement. I'm seeing you're going to achieve something in the near future. I'm seeing, seeing something big happening. Okay. So I'm definitely seeing that these love offers that are coming towards you is more likely uh, childish. I'm seeing they're not very mature in placing relationships over um attention both of them are seeking attention in their own way and the fact that it's not affecting you at all is bothering these options one person thinks oh they're not interested in my money how come another person is how come they're not interested in my body so i feel both of these options are acting smart to get but they don't realize that they're behaving like a fool Okay, they're behaving stupid. They're behaving like a kid. But you, on the flip side, are more mature and know how to have, uh, handle things. Very happy. I'm seeing Gemini, big movement is taking place. You will achieve something big. Like a big success is right off the bat coming towards you. Some of you are 25 here or even 52, maybe somewhere in between. Your family will be proud of you. You are doing something which will make you extremely honored, respected in your family, first of all, in your circle, first of all. And even at your work, you're rising, your position is growing, you're becoming more and more successful. Okay? I'm also seeing you building a family in your future. In the near future, I'm seeing someone very respectful, someone extremely honorable is coming towards you to shower you with all the happiness in the world, to give you the respect that you were looking for, the love that you were looking for. I hate who I really am from you. I feel like you're dealing with these people who are not honest, who are not true to themselves either. So you're not dealing with some positive people around you, you're dealing with very negative, like still struggling to find their place kind of people around you. Whereas you've already found your abundance, you've already found your happiness, your success, and you're living your life king size. So that is why you will see people wanting you, but at the same time not wanting you. Okay? So this is more like they depend on you for something, but they don't want to have a spiritual bond. So wait for the spiritual bond coming into your life. Until then, you're busy loving yourself. Your family loves you. Whoever is close to you right now loves you. I'm also seeing one more thing. You're protective about your personal decisions or you're making your plans private. You don't want to discuss any of it with anyone, even in your family. And that makes you mysterious and more difficult to disturb or challenge or bother. Yeah, so I'm seeing beautiful relationships are coming into your life. Abundance is coming into your life, okay? So, you're attracting, I feel like whoever is honest with you, genuine is with you, is going to build honest relationship. Like, for example, your auntie, your uncle, your siblings, your friends, they will be trying to build a stronger relationship because you have money. You're becoming more independent. You're very much in your power. And whoever is trying to mess with you, they know they can't because you're at this position right now where you're unshakable. You're being patient with relationships. You're being really, really patient with relationships. Someone that has been continuously disregarding you and you kept on dealing with it with grace. But now the time has come where you will be in power and you will see the past trying to come back asking for forgiveness like let me let me just get back with you i'm so sorry i want to make up to you you know 
this person that was just interested in you for their personal reasons is now taking interest in more things in your life but now you know the real personality so don't want to deal with them so currently i'm not talking about new love because right now both of these options are just kiddish and you're more in this energy of this is my era this is the gemini's era let me have fun let me enjoy my life you're the queen of your castle or the king so currently the relationships that you are talking to the people that you're talking to right now are not at the same page as you are they're not at the same page okay they don't deserve you even though you can trust them but you just yourself do not feel like connecting with these options because it just doesn't come from the source of love or spirituality you want something more real okay yes reflection the reason why you see someone from the past trying to come back gemini is clearly because you gave them space you let them go you didn't stop them you didn't argue you didn't say anything you're like you were complete shut and you're like okay fine you want to leave we can leave and that's the reason why they went through a self-reflection and realized they were at fault and they are coming back with this energy of let's get it back together let's let's be in a relationship and stuff like that well you know it is their own um karma and they're working on it you have your own karma so you really do not want to be a part of their life or want to be bothered okay so you're in this happy space right now travel i'm seeing you traveling okay i'm seeing you traveling to a place that gives you more happiness and freedom and you will bring a new idea to work okay when you travel something new will strike your mind and you'll come up with something like a new hustle or a business opportunity or a skill that you will be learning Yes, you have found out that all of these options that are coming towards you, one or two options coming towards you, is not worth your time. So you have decided to not even ask or try to fix things with this person because you can see that they are not your person. Somewhere they are below your league. You still gave them a chance. Now you don't want to do that again. All right. Yes, community. Now let me see what that is. Means your society. Something is there. Let's see. Oh wow! You're making your community proud. Your society, your neighborhood people, all of them are talking nice things about you. You're making them proud. They feel like you're so lucky, you're so blessed that you got this, you got that. You're so lucky, you're making money, you're rich, you're successful. All of these beautiful things they've been talking behind your back. And they're also looking for, I feel like there are some people around you, like your neighbors and all. They've been talking about your marriage and they're wanting to introduce you to someone that you can feel a connection with, I feel. But anyway, I'm seeing you won. At one point of time, there were people around that were like judging you, poking you. But now, they are proud of your achievements. They are patting on your back. They're telling you, wow, how did you do this? Okay? They're proud of your success. They could be a Libra. If the reason is because either you built a new home yourself or you will be building a new home, a big house of your own money in the near future some of you i feel they can see your community your surroundings this these people can see how much you've struggled worked hard followed your passion your dreams to make it so big and they just want to be they want to surround you wherever you go you feel surrounded by them they don't want to leave you alone okay they're obsessed with your success gemini let's see what are the signs of love coming through
we have Leo, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Aries towards Gemini, please. This person is moving on. They cut the cards and now they're moving on because they don't have much money and they're jealous of you. Taurus doesn't want to see you happy. They always freak out when they see you happy. Gemini. This person is very conscious that you might be dating someone else. Since the day you guys stopped talking to each other, they're like, oh my gosh, I hope the Gemini hasn't found someone else. They're very jealous of you. I'm also seeing them crying here or too worried about you falling in love with someone else. Cancer. They're feeling strong pull. They're trying to control their horses, but this person eventually is coming towards you. Leo. This person has been planning to reach out to you, ask you for a date. This person is rich. They could be a job person. Okay, then you're seeing Virgo. They're manifesting you, okay? The Virgo is manifesting you. And the reason is why they're not coming towards you on your face is because they have, either they're young, plus... They have low financial backup, which makes them a little underconfident and insecure around you. Libra. Wow. This person has been wanting to make an offer towards you. They're flirtatious. They want to impress you so that you accept their offer of marriage. Scorpio. Okay, the Scorpio person is stressed out. Either they're with someone else they want to leave for you or they don't want you to be with someone else and that is making them crazy. Sagittarius. Okay. This person is conscious. Like all of these options are really conscious if you're moving on to someone else. Again, Sagittarius is worried that you might choose someone else. Capricorn, that you're with someone else. They have this, this skepticism going on in their head that you may be with someone else. Capricorn. This person wants to marry you. Very possessive. Aquarius. They want to settle down basically this person wants to settle down but a part of them sees an agenda behind this because you're rich or you can help them with money pisces i feel they just want to focus on themselves they want to take a break from you they're tired they just want to be on their own Okay, take a vacation. You'll be going out somewhere. Someone is a doctor here. Or you're taking good care of yourself. You may have gotten hurt or something. So doctor is helping you. Maybe that's a doctor that you're falling in love with. Or someone is falling in love with you. Someone's name is Drew, Dre, Darren, Derek. Okay, I'm seeing a spiritually uh, beautiful journey in your life is taking place. Okay. So I'm seeing that uh, you're becoming more and more spiritual. You're loving the idea of being in this uh, spiritual journey. Okay. So I feel this will also, this also means that you're being protected by nature, by angels and spirit guides around. 
I've seen the color red. Oh my gosh. Maybe red makes you look really good. Someone has complimented you. Are you taking good care of yourself? Wear more red. You will attract love in your life. If you wear more red. Ready. I'm also seeing love, honor, respect. You wear a uniform. Your person wears a uniform. That is coming towards you. Yes, I'm seeing these love offers that are coming towards you. Coming with some envy. Because you're better than them. You're leading in your life. Some of you are in health sector or taking good care of your health. I'm also seeing someone's negative eyes affected your health as well. So protect yourself. Keep a feather. Wherever you find a feather, keep it in your purse. Protect it. Or in your car. It's time for you to have fun. Play some music. And be in this lighthearted energy. Get together. Partying. Like cafe, coffee, and all of these things will make you feel good sure your person could have these letters as initials r e and d yes you're balancing your life you're trying your best to balance your life and feel good about yourself okay oh it's my dog yeah i'm seeing you taking a vacation going somewhere probably dubai Okay, so that's about it. I hope you enjoyed this wonderful read. You could be doctors, yeah, or your person is. You can meet someone new at a vacation. But be careful of the envy around. It's a lot of envy because you're doing really good. So that is about it. I hope you enjoyed this wonderful read. Thank you for your time, Gemini. Do like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye.